It is always a good idea to have a spare hot end module laying around. It can be used as a backup or as a completely separate setup that is easily swappable. You could have a hot end with a 0.5mm nozzle and one ready to go with a 1mm nozzle, for example. Swapping out the hot end is made easy on the Evo and can be done in a matter of minutes. You will start off by preheating the hot end and removing any filament left loaded in the machine. Now power down the machine and let the hot end cool down completely. Once cool, turn to the back of the machine, making sure to have a good view behind the hot end. Grab the first plug by hand and pull it to remove. Repeat this step for the second plug. The plugs will be tight, so make sure to be careful. If the plugs will not remove easily, you can use a large pair of pliers to assist you in pulling out the plugs. If using tools, make sure to be extremely careful around the hot end and with the plugs themselves. Moving back to the front of the machine, the two hot end bolts will now be loosened. Using an M3 hex key, completely loosen the bolts inside the holes which are located to the right and left of the fan housing bolts. You can see the fan housing bolt heads, but not the hot end bolt heads. With one hand under the extruder assembly, carefully remove it from the machine. Check to make sure the new hot end unit has the bolts installed. If not, take them out of the removed unit and put them in the hot end being installed. Place the hot end onto the machine, paying close attention to line up the two bolts on the back to the hot end bracket. Screw in the two bolts, making sure to tighten them all the way. With the hot end installed, plug the cables into the respective ports on the back. It is suggested to use dielectric grease on the connectors. Make sure the cables are plugged in all the way. After installing, make sure to level the nozzles and run a test print. 